Good morning, everybody. It's Miss Carrie with another Crafty Thursday on this super rainy morning. So today we're going to be making paper plate boxes. So your first step is to get a plate, paper plate, and I painted mine orange. So that's going to be your first step. I've already done that step um, so that the paint could dry so I could show you how to do it. And the other step, I'm going to post a link to the template if you would like to use the template for the face and the ears and the nose for our fox. So, our first step is to color our ears. So, for the face part, you don't have to color that one. But we're going to color the ears first. And we're going to color those orange. So, that's your first step after you paint your plate. Miss Karen is coloring. Have you ever seen a real fox? I have. One night I was driving out of my grandparents' driveway and they live in the country. So that means sometimes you see animals out there like possums and foxes. So I was driving out of their driveway and it was nighttime. And my headlights that you used to see while you drive, they caught a pair of eyes that looked like they were glowing. And after the headlights hit the eyes, I saw some of the shadow of the animal and it was a fox. And I was like, oh my goodness, I just saw a fox. So I was super excited to see the fox. If you ever see one out in the wild, don't approach it because there are, they are animals and they might be scared. So just leave it alone. But it was really cool to see that fox, I must admit. So we've got our orange ears. And next, I'm going to color the nose, which is black. Okay, I've got our nose. And my last step is to color the cheeks, which are pink. So I've got my marker. I'm going to color that. All right, so now we've got our three parts colored. So what's our next step gonna be, do you think? Cut it out, that's right. So I've got my scissors, there they are. They're right here. So we're going to cut these shapes out. It's a really rainy day today. It's a good day to stay inside and read and do a fun craft. Got our ears. So next is the nose and the cheeks. And we'll also need to cut out the face too. But you don't have to color that part unless you would just like to. if y'all remember there was a song several years ago called what does the fox say and it was a silly song that had cuckoo sounds and it was just a really funny funny song that's what it reminds that's what this kind of makes me think of too it's 
So now I'm cutting out the face. I wonder what kind of sound a fox does make. Seems like I remember one of my friends that also lives in the country said a fox makes kind of a screaming sound, so it could be a little bit scary. All right, so we've got all of our fox pieces cut out. So we've got the face, the ears, the nose, and the cheeks. So our first step is to glue down the face. So we're gonna take our handy dandy glue stick and put glue on the back of our face for the box. There we go. Okay, so we got the glue on it. What you're going to do is you're going to place it along the bottom. So we're going to place it right there along the bottom of the plate. So you can put it like that. And then we're going to glue our cheeks on to give the fox a little rosy look. And put that right there under the eyes. Like that, okay. And then we're going to glue down his nose. And it's going to go right here above the mouth. Put it right there. Okay. And last but not least are our fox's ears. So I'm going to put the glue on the... Ah! You want Miss Carrie down? I glued it on the back. Oh well. We can glue it on the front. So I'm going to put one ear right here. That's okay. Oh, might need to move it down some. There we go. Got it. Okay. Put that on the other side. And then we have our box. So, we've got the steps. And Miss Carrie's going to post the link if you would like to use the template which is what Miss Carrie used to cut out and to color. And if you do the craft, please post a picture of it on our Facebook so I can see it, because I love to see what you guys are up to. So I'll talk to you soon. See you next time. Bye.